Hi, my name is Sharon Redman, and I'd like to tell you a little bit about my new article in Crystal entitled Zooming In, Zooming Out, Addressing Ideology in a South African University Classroom. In it, I reflect on a section of a first year university language course which focuses on the concept of ideology, how it works and what to do with it when you find it. In the paper, I describe some of the theory which forms part of the course, as well as the strategies of zooming in and zooming out, which we use in addressing ideology. The theoretical understanding provided by the content of the course enables students to identify ideological patterns of thought at work in class tasks, society, and finally within themselves. The strategies of zooming in and zooming out proved accessible to students and many referenced them in their feedback. These strategies emerge from the theoretical content but they are easy to understand and apply. The issue we focus on in this course in terms of application is the influence of ideology on how we as South Africans perceive one another, particularly in terms of different language groups but as the students the feedback implies the issues dealt with extend much further than simply that. The feedback on the course indicates that many students were prompted to make explicit and examine their own ideological assumptions on these issues. I'm excited to share this with you because part of the outcome of this module was for a number of students a sense of newness in terms of how they perceive one another and the potential for relationship with one another. And I believe that this was able to happen because they were given the tools to understand their own ideological biases and how to address them.